again. Hope everyone's doing good. Happy hump day to everyone. I hope your day has gone well and you're well rested, getting ready to go home and relax. Or those of you who are working nights, you have rested during the day and you're getting ready to go in with a good attitude and a burst of joy. I'm coming back today because I have Brindley with me again today. And this time, Brindley has been changed into this cute little romper set. It's like a, it can be a sleeper or either a play, a play um, outfit for her. And I just thought she was so cute in it. Look at it. Um, again, she is the April Sculpt by Joanna Casimir Check, and she is 20 inches. I still have not weighed her, and I still have not made the adjustments to her um, head yet. But um, I'll be making those today. I just wanted to come again and just say hello to everybody and wish you a, a happy week. Hoping that you have been filled with joy and loving every minute. And that you have gotten out there and you have voted. There is early voting going on for a lot of places. And, you know, just let your voice be heard and go and vote. Um, that's, the mo that's the most important thing that we can do as um, American people, as people in general who have the right to vote, to go and vote. All right, but I just wanted to come today with her, and we've had a good day today. It's been uh, a pretty productive day at work. <laughs> I am off now, um, getting ready to head in for the day. I stopped um, at a few stores, and um, just a few, no shopping. Just a few stores, um, get some important items that I needed. And um, now I'm getting ready to head back into the house and to get rested up and relaxed for another um, productive day <laughs> of work tomorrow. But guys, I do not want to stay long. As always, please do not allow anyone to steal your joy. Please don't. Um, that is our daily message. That is the message. Do not let anyone enter your positive bubble with negativity. That is not the way to go. You want to block that junk out and just keep it moving. Your life, enjoying it the way you want to live it. And as Springflower says, your doll is your way. When you know it's your doll is your way, you won't allow anyone to steal your joy. That's how I kind of mix it all together. But we are a doll connection meaning any kind of dolls that you would like to um, share on this Dolly group and Dolly connection. And you be free, uh, feel free to do that. There is no discrimination here against where your dolls came from, what type of doll you have. It can be a Barbie doll, it can be an Amazon doll, it can be an AliExpress doll, it can be an actual reborn doll, it can be a baby alive, it can be whatever you want it to be. It can be a stuffed animal. It is collectors enjoying a hobby enjoying something that we really love doing and being able to share it with other people who have the same joy in doing that particular hobby that's what it's about it's about um making connections and sharing joy and love everywhere that we go and it's so important and as long as we remember that god is love we won't forget who we are and what we're about we all have a purpose we all have a purpose. And with that purpose, we're supposed to be giving God the glory. You know, whatever you believe, wherever you are, giving God the glory and going on in your way and the way he would have you to go. And that is loving everyone that you come in contact with and remembering how you like to be treated so that you don't forget how you would feel so that you can share that same love with someone else, right? We know we don't want to be mistreated. We won't mistreat somebody else. But you know, someone, some people don't get the message. But we are here to continue to voice that message to you and to let you know that you are loved. Regardless, you are loved. We have a God who has unconditional love. And those are people who want to pick and choose who they want to love, who they want to like, who they don't want to like, that's them. You just have to keep move, keep it moving and continue to be positive, continue to show love, continue to connect with people who want to connect with you and who want to enjoy things with you. And that's how you stay positive and you keep 
a, a, a positive form and a positive group following you and a positive group of people who are around you, people who are spreading love. If you hang around with people who love other people, no matter how you feel at that moment, you start loving other people. That's the way it goes. It just spreads. If you want to hang around nasty people, you continue to hang around nasty people. And even if you're a loving person, you hang around with them enough, you'll start to be feeling negative. Like, why am I feeling this way? Because it's that it's that energy that you're around. And you don't want to be around that. All right? So, guys, continue to continue on. Continue to keep pressing on to that final mark. And that final mark is going home with the Lord. But we have things we got to do down here. It's so much work we have to do. So much. And I'm speaking to myself also because we get in that role sometimes where, you know, we just want some quiet peace. And, you know, we're going to have peace regardless. But also we have work to do. We are soldiers who are supposed to be staying in the army and staying on the front line to pull people in to God's army so that, you know, there are people who will continue to spread his love, spread his joy, spread his message. So not trying to press my religion on you, but we have to love one another. That's just the way it is. We're supposed to love one another and we're supposed to love one another sincerely. So with that, Brindley and I are going to say bye for now. But guys, you take care. Have a wonderful night. And I will see you guys on the next round. Hobbs and Dorber Cuties is out. And Brimley and I say bye-bye. All right, guys. Bye for now. Bye.